pretty amazing. Get your pens and paper ready, ladies of the low country. Miss Angie Ravenel is here with makeup tips you can't miss on our Makeover Monday. Angie, welcome. Thank you. It's so great to have you here, and I was just flipping through the book, and, and what we were just talking about, you're making this very easy. I am. Especially things like the smoky eye, which seems to be this anomaly when it comes to <laughs> putting on makeup. Just explain a little bit about the book and kind of what we can expect if we pick one of these up. Okay, well, I started the book maybe about a year and a half mm -hmm. ago, and I had so many notes and so many things to say, and I narrowed it down. It's a 56-page uh, tutorial, mm -hmm. step-by-step guide, befores and afters, so it's a really easy easy read mm -hmm. uh, book. I wanted to make sure of that, because I think a lot of people run away from something you right. know, the size of an encyclopedia, right. whereas, like, oh, God, I can't do that. So it's for the everyday woman to right. have those you know, some confidence and help them with their makeup application. Do you think that the book is made for somebody that has no idea how to even start, since it's called Makeup 101? Is it a little bit easier for that person? So I don't even know what to do first. Exactly. Okay. And that's exactly what Good. it is. Mm -hmm. um, I talked about tools. I talk about different yeah. types of foundations and the reason for using them, the yeah. reason for using powder. Uh, you know, a little bit of do's and don'ts. So, and it's for somebody who already wears makeup as well. Okay. So it doesn't have to be for somebody who doesn't wear any makeup. Right, because I was noticing in here there's step-by-step -step tutorials. And, I mean, it's so simple to just go through here and just kind of, you start from start to finish. And it's amazing. I mean, it looks very, very, you make it look easy. You know, makeup can be intimidating. It can be. And that's why I just wanted to uh, keep, um, it's an easy read and mm -hmm. keep it basic. And um, so people can just follow the book easily right. and apply their makeup. Well, Angie, what about those moms out there? I know we have a lot of moms that watch this show. And the cool thing about it is, a lot of times moms, they want to look beautiful, but they don't have time to put everything on before they head to the bus stop or before they head out to work. What are some key things that we need to make sure that we do before we walk out of the house? That's a great question, and I get that a lot because time is everything. It's money. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> it is. And even if you're a stay-at-home mom, you still want to look, you know, your best, right. enhance, you know, your looks. Um, I believe a tinted moisturizer, oh, okay. easy to apply. Maybe something around the eyes, a little bit of bronzer to give you a sun-kissed look or some blush to kind of brighten you up would be a great, and, and this, you can do that in five minutes. So a five-minute makeup makeover is possible. Okay. Wow. Well, tell me, oh, look, that's our uh, Tessa Spencer, our yes, good Tessa. friend. She looks great. Yes. Tessa looks good without makeup or with makeup, but you made her look, look at that. Yep. And that's one of the models as well. And that's I did a step-by-step -step on her and... That's another step-by-step -step application yeah. from beginning to end, and that's her after look. Well, Angie, thank you so much. Where can we pick the book up at? Uh, you can go on my website, angieshairstudio.com. Great. There's a link there. Purchase it and Wonderful. Yeah, apply your makeup. Thank you. Well, she's Angie Ravenel, and she's given us makeup tips that we can all use. Thank you so much, Angie. Thank you, Laura. All right, well, get your best.